In this video, I'll take you through the setup of a solar-powered PTZ camera. This is the solar-powered PTZ camera we'll be using for this video demonstration. And this is the solar panel that supplies power to the camera by recharging an inbuilt battery in the camera. You can either position the panel on top of the camera, just as it is on the box, or you can place it at a suitable location for maximum sunlight. There are various provisions made on the camera. The top here holds a SIM card through which internet can be supplied to the camera. And then also at this point is a provision for a TF card to hold video recordings from the camera. This is the reset button. It is used to reset the camera to default. This is a micro SIM card that can fit into the SIM card slot of the camera. And so I will try and put it into the camera. You push it down and then it will lock into the camera. I also have my TF card here, so I'll just put it into its slot. Make sure it locks well. So we'll now connect the solar panel. Here is the end of the solar panel cable. We'll join it to this provided extension cable so that we can comfortably place the panel at a suitable location. This end is what will go into the camera. So this other end will be connected this way. And make sure the weather boot is rolled over the joint properly. So the joint is well established now. And this now means that the panel can be placed at quite a distant position from the camera. So this is the end that goes into the camera. So I'll plug it into the camera this way. And then you can open the side where you can find the on and off switch and turn on the camera. You can see that there is light flashing on the camera, which suggests that there is power now present in the camera. This camera is operated and controlled from a mobile phone. So the next step to do is to go onto the phone and do the phone setup so that we can be able to view and control the camera from the mobile phone. This particular camera operates through an app called the U-Box, which is available on Play Store or iStore to be downloaded for free. You may have to refer to your user manual to find the specific app that is used for your brand of solar-powered PTZ camera. When you open the U-Box app, this is how the interface looks. To add a camera, you tap on Add Device. Select Setup 4G Device. There are various instructions here that requires that we insert the SIM card, install the antenna, and then power on the device, all of which we've already done. It also says that the blue LED will light up. Here is the blue LED being referred to. So we'll click the blue LED is on and tap on Next. So we will now scan the QR code on the camera, which is referring to this particular QR code on the camera. So I will use the phone to scan it up. It has picked up. So the camera connection is now being established. We will have to name the camera, but you can also choose any of these provided names if that is where you placed the camera. So I will choose front door as my camera name. Tap on next. Camera installed successfully. OK. You can just tap this area to view live pictures of the camera. And there you have it. But my internet is buffering heavily, so the pictures are not so fluid. But when you have very good internet on your SIM card, you should be able to have better pictures from your camera. Thank you so much for watching this video. See you in the next video.
Thank you.